Hi, right, what's up, everyone? Uh, today I'm going to show you the Aplo Aplo tools and how you can manage it and what what does it offer. Obviously, uh, you can add in uh, your Google Analytics that's up to your site, or I believe it only goes through Google Analytics. So if you don't have Google Analytics, you can sign up. It's free, easy to manage. Um, but from here. You have uh, managed keywords. Uh, you can say uh, this Facebook in general, and you can actually add that. Uh, if you have the pro version, which which this is a free version, uh, you you can only use ten words. I believe I have exactly ten now, and you you can track your keywords according to traffic. Uh, next is your health check. If you have any issues, it, it, it will tell you on your on page, your performance, your indexing, uh, uh, open issues, and done and, and ignore it. All mine have been fixed, except for a couple of these. Uh, a lot of these are old. But I was planning on going in. Go later and fix them and see if, if there's actually any issues. So from there, uh, if you want, you can go inside a, a GT matrix and to check your actual site and see how your actual performance is going. But we will go back in here. Then you have your traffic tab, and you have to figure this is in this is within a nine day period usually for your rankings and this is my and you, you get to see your bounce rate, your average time on site uh, your exit rate and these are all for different different pages this is me because that's my admin uh, page view 71 I mean you can go down the list and see what, what pages people are staying on, what pages people are not are not even entering. Then you can go down to the revenue tab. Uh, you can and you have ClickBank. Uh, I don't know if you have ClickBank. I was thinking about actually joining ClickBank and maybe start doing that. Then from there you have your rankings. Which this is actually going to give you an overall analysis. I haven't, I haven't hooked the Bing yet, so mine's mostly on Google. You see, I'm ranking for some keywords, and my site is less than 90 days old. I've, obviously, I don't have a trend for a lot of these because a lot of these are pretty much brand new. Like, if you look at this, this is actually authorship, and these are actually rankings. If you click on this, this actually goes to your, your actual page, but if you want to click here this actually goes to the, to the web page itself uh, it says I'm on three but I actually look and I'm on I'm on the second page which is still pretty good because our, our people are still gonna look on the second page I mean I haven't gotten no Lincoln's yet but you can see how it's gonna help inside out of your traffic source and with your SEO efforts uh, then this year's just your backlink analysis uh, as I said, all this is within a 90 day period, so you, you won't really get no, get no history on it. I mean, you, you can go where to find links, and there, there's this little video that you can go through to, uh, get a better overview on, on, uh, on anything on here, because all of them have videos, and it tells you how to properly set it up. And you have Facebook. Facebook, uh, this is more for your fan page rather than your personal page. So if this is more of a business, a business type of business type of deal. I mean, in here you can schedule schedule posts that you that you want to put in there, and you got you also got Twitter. Uh, 
and keyword is more for the of the keyword research. So if you're actually looking for uh, let's see, Facebook strategy, and you can search in the U.S. or where or wherever you want to go, and and you can look at the competition. And all of these are really, really high. Or you can put in Facebook marketing strategies, and you can search. And see the actual how competitive it is. Uh, lo local monthly volume is 590. This is 260 with 83 million uh, pieces. Obviously, I I'm currently on this is about 260 uh, volume range of monthly local. So it's, it's your best bet to try to get on a top rank of some of these high ones. I mean, you uh, you always don't want to do long tail. You you, you can do do some uh, some medium or or short tail. The medium uh, that's a different video to learn about the long tail, short tail, and uh, like in between tail. Or this is specific to medium tail. Then domains is pretty much if you, you want a certain domain, you can try to see if you can find it. If not, then you can. Go and get a new, new domain and knowing that no one else has it. Then links. Links is for backlinking. Uh, so you just choose resources, directories, sponsors, reviews, guest posts and commenting, article directories. I mean, you can, I mean, it'll give you a huge list. So you, we can just go with uh, Facebook in general to actually find links. But for right now, I'm going to go back to this. I'll take a minute and just show you my performance on my site. I, I still have a couple things that I have to do on my site to make it a little better. But overall, it's, it's, it's decent. Uh, page speed grade is almost an A, which is loading at 1.56 per second, which is, I mean, I don't know what your page speed is. And uh, Google has this thing now of page speed. Uh, it's going to be resourced toward the rankings itself in general. But from here, you can see you hover over this. This is your domain authority and your your page authority. So if you want to, if you want to kind of do it for, uh, on a decent page authority. So if we would click on this, this has a page authority of three. What what I usually try to look for is a six or a seven, but if, if there's not a lot of articles that that are in there that that's gonna be helpful for me, then I, I usually break it down and I, I might even do a three or four. But usually I do like a six, seven, or eight uh, with, with, with with my backlinking. But from there, but that. that that's pretty much the breakdown of everything. I mean, pretty much it, you can go in here, you can try new things, and you, you can do what you need to do. But overall, it's it, it makes it a little easier with with backlinking. Um, but a, a key is your performance. I mean, there's a lot of people sites that I go on that load really slow, and me being a designer, that 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 kind of throws throws me off, and I'm kind of just leave on, unless I actually know they have good content that I'll stay but if not I, I, I'll use this leave but anyways that is my that is my review on uh, Apple tools uh, Apple tools is a pretty pretty good overall overall deal as you see there's four, 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 429 potential potential links and I mean uh, you, you can search for anything I mean there's, there's tons and tons of things that, of, of backlinks and, and and you can manage all of them and try to rank your site. I mean, all this stuff is going to take time, and, and everyone thinks with websites are just it's constant. You have to constantly update. You have to constantly do a lot of stuff. So, all right, everyone, that, that that's my little review on on this on this little tool. If you got any questions? Uh, I'll have a link 
at the bottom of my website and, and to my Facebook. Uh, you need to ask me a question, just get a hold of me. I'll talk to you next week. I have one page.